Hey guys, what is up? It's me, it's Sonne, and today I've got a new video for you guys. Let me change the light so you guys can see me way better because this is just not it. <laughs> This is probably better, isn't it? Yeah, this is way better. <laughs> Today, we are gonna play another episode of Rule Breaker. Yeah, that's what we're gonna do today. Today, we are gonna be playing another episode of Rule Breaker. And let me see which episode we're on. We're on episode eight of 15. So let's get it started, shall we? Let's get it started, yeah. Let's get it started, yeah. First, we of course have ads. Episode 8, Midnight Snack. She's trying to kill me. <gasps> you bitch. Oh, shut up. Issa told me her back hurt. And as the kind daughter you raised me to be, I helped her out. You're welcome. Thanks. Uh, okay. What are you doing home so soon? Aren't you supposed to be gone for another week at least? I got two days off, so I go on the plane home straight away. I've missed you. I've missed you too. Hold on for a second. What is it? Is that a tattoo? Oh shit. Oh, is that a tattoo? Yeah, do you like it? Oh dear lord, I'm going to faint. Isa, you were supposed to look after her! It's not that easy. She's a wild one. Hey, I heard you are a wild one. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Beautiful. Dad, I'm 18. I can get a tattoo if I want to. Ugh, why can't you stay young forever? Ask the universe. Same. Have you been getting along well? No. Yes, there's been no trouble at all. Except when she's plotting my death, of course. You have a great sense of humor, Issa. It's that's that's not a joke. <laughs> that's not that's not a joke, honey. Who said I was joking? Are you guys free right now? I'm thinking dinner. There's a new restaurant downtown that's had great reviews. Actually, I've met someone. I'm supposed to see her tonight since we couldn't do lunch. Oh, you've met someone already, huh? That's great. I'd love to meet her. In fact, why don't you bring her to dinner? No! I'm sure Issa and Ava have other things to do. Nah, dinner will be great. Great! No. Can you be ready in about half an hour? Yeah, sure. Perfect! Hey Haley, wait up! What? The bet was fun and all, but you don't have to carry on with it. I just really wanted to win, and now that I have, we can just drop it. Why are you being so nice? Are you up to something? I'll see you at dinner, Haley. Fuck. Shit. Fuck. I don't trust this. So much to choose from. I know! I should wear the dress that I bought with candy a few days ago. We're gonna have to pay for that option, don't we? Damn, this outfit looks so good on me. Does it? The color combination is bomb. I hate it. Hey, are you ready yet? Whoa! Do you like this outfit? Very much. You look insanely hot. I mean, nice. Thanks. I also have another outfit. We're gonna have to go with this because that's episode. What do you think? That's interesting. Hmm. I guess it's formal at least. Uh, sure. I will go with the first option though. I'll wait at the door for you while you make up your mind. She's right. The first, um, the first outfit did look amazing on me. <laughs> yes, 
This new floral gown is the real deal. All eyes will definitely be on me in this outfit. Rock the gorgeous outfit and get a new hairstyle or settle for the vest. I hate this game. Is this really what I want to wear to, the, to dinner tonight? No. I guess this will do. Wow, this restaurant is lovely and the view is amazing. Thank you for letting, uh, for letting, thank you for letting me accompany you. Of course. I'm glad Issa has found herself a decent girl. She has a habit of falling for the wrong girls. Oh, does she now? Oh yes, she definitely knows how to attract the wrong type of women. What's that supposed to mean? Dad, did you know that my friend Melissa is bisexual? What are you doing? No, I didn't know that. Uh, <gasps> I know what she's doing. Wow, Issa looks really uncomfortable right now. Should I tell Dad that Melissa tried to seduce Issa? It could be pretty fun to mess with Issa and Dad. Mess with Issa or don't risk it. It's not like she's been playing nice to us. Fuck it, we're just gonna mess with her. Melissa wanted to come over to study a few days ago. But after she saw Issa, she wasn't that interested in studying anymore. Did we maybe make the wrong choice? I don't... Excuse me? Oh, no, 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 no. Nothing happened. I made it very clear that I wasn't interested in her. You better not be. You can't hook up with my daughter's friends. Oh, I love this. Add some drama to this. Thank you. Why haven't you told me this? Because there's nothing to tell. I didn't touch her. I did not touch her. It's not true. It's bullshit. I did not touch her. Good. Well, aren't we having fun? Oh, I love this. The food is just lovely. Uh, yes. Lovely. I need a drink. I don't know about you guys, but I'm pretty full. Me too. My stomach can't handle more. Should we ask for the check? Yes, please. I like that. That was fun. <laughs> Thanks for the lovely evening. I'm glad you invited me. Least I could do for skipping lunch with, lunch with you. Yeah, why did you skip lunch? You just left me on my own. I had something important to do. What? Just personal stuff. I think your cab is here. <laughs> I'll see you later. Oh, God. <laughs> ah, shoot. I have to take this. It's work. At this hour? Time zones. Who were you texting? Whoa. You're a little too close, buddy. Don't think you... Don't, don't think you mind it, though. What are you doing? Uh... Can I help you? Why did you tell your dad? You know nothing happened between us. I just couldn't help myself. You couldn't help yourself? You almost risked my relationship with your dad and Ava. You're overreacting. Overre now get out of my way, please. Is everything okay? Of course! Ready to go home? Uh, yes. Let's go. I can't believe you had dinner with Ava and Issa tonight! I wonder if they've done it. Ew! Candy, stop! I don't want to think about that. Candy, we'd better hang up now. It's two in the, mor two in the morning, Jesus. Shit, we've been talking for three hours? Seems like it. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye! Oh, bye! <laughs> what was that noise? I didn't hear shit. What are you talking about? It was my stomach. How could I possibly be hungry again? Well, I can't deny my belly food. That's just wrong. <gasps> She's making a booty call! What are you up to? Nothing special. I miss you. 
And I feel a little lonely. Really? Yes. Too bad you aren't here. Guess what I'm wearing? Why don't you tell me? Cause... No? A pair of earrings. And... That's it. Oh. I see. <laughs> Ava, are you trying to have phone sex with me? That's hot. Yeah, I'm thinking about it too. I shouldn't listen to this. No, you shouldn't. Yeah, of course. Shit. Ava, I've got to go. Enjoying the show? Didn't mean to listen to over here. Why is it that every time Ava and I are getting down to business, you're there? Because you're always in a public fucking place. Maybe that's why. Wrong place at the wrong time? Was that a question? No? I mean, no. Excuse me. I bet you're wondering what it's like to be with a real woman. The kind of woman that knows how to make you feel good. Uh, Issa, you're, you're, you're a little too close. <laughs> Issa grabbed my hips and pushed me against the kitchen counter. I was trapped between her arms and her face was mere inches away from mine. And then her dad walks in. And then her dad walks in. Oh shit, her dad walks in. The only sound was her heavy breathing until I heard footsteps. Your dad is coming! Isa? James! Hey, what are you doing up? Couldn't sleep. Bitch, fuck off! Were you talking to someone just now? Uh, yeah, I was on the phone with Ava. Well, it's not a lie. She's a sweet girl. I'm glad you're getting over Tina. Tina who? Well, I'm just gonna grab a glass of water and head to bed. N no! I mean, I'll get it for you. <coughs> Thanks. Good night. Night. Go to bed. What's the matter with you? I wish I knew. Issa was acting really strange tonight. Yeah, she was horny and she wanted you. <laughs> I'll ask her about it tomorrow. No, you won't. You won't. You'll forget it. You'll, you'll, you'll forget it the next day. What should I wear today? Simple. That's cute. Let me see another. Ooh, that's cute. Tomboy, I think I'm gonna like this. Eh, no. Queen B. Ugh, no, nope, nope, beach chick. No, yeah, no, we're gonna go with attitude. Yeah. <laughs> Should I wear this? Yes, I look fucking good. Good morning. Good morning. Today is a wonderful day. Good morning, Dad. Ready for school? I can take her to school. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm on my way to work anyway. I don't mind dropping her off. All right, if you're sure. Yikes! You don't usually start work this early. Keeping tabs on me, are you? I'm just observant. Don't flatter yourself. Thanks for the ride. You're welcome. Is there any reason why you over to drive me? Y yeah, I actually wanted to talk to you. Oh god. It's about what happened last night. Do you have a minute to listen to what I've got to say? I mean, I do, but episode is going to say that I don't, so it's pretty important. I really need to know what Issa is about to say about last night. Maybe I can finally get to know if she has feelings for me. Listen to Issa and find out what's on her mind or leave. We have to leave, fuckers. Sorry, I have to go or else I'll be late for class. All right, but we're cool, right? We're cool, don't worry.
I hate this game. Good morning, everyone. Uh, oh God, no, and that, uh. Good morning, everyone. I hope you get, had a good weekend. I know I did. Uh, no, stop it. I know I did. A quick reminder that the school trip is this Friday and that today is the last day to sign up for it. She forgot it, didn't she? I can't believe you're not going on, on the trip. I am. I signed up this morning. Are you serious? I'm so happy right now. <gasps> Isa's gonna be joining us as chaperone, isn't she? Yup. Hey, Haley. Ryan. Hey. I heard you signed up for the trip. Oh, no. No, I didn't. No, I did not. Yeah, I did. Cool. So, I was wondering if you'd like to sit next to me on the bus. Dude, what the fuck? Are you eight? Don't. Oh. Uh, um. Haley, can I see you in my office for a moment? Thank fucking God. Yes, of course. See you later, Ryan. Yeah. See you. Sorry for stealing you away from your friend like that. You saved me. I owe you my life. Should be sorry. Can we make this quick? I have a life to get back to. Well, she kind of saved me, so... You saved me. I owe you my life. Stealing? You saved me. Thank God. I owe you my life. Oh, in that case, you're welcome. First of all, I just wanted to let you know that I think it's super fun that you signed up for the trip. Me and the three other teachers are going to travel with you. I thought there were going to be five teachers traveling with us. Ah, uh, yes. One of the teachers won't be able to make it, and we're having a hard time finding a replacement. That's what I wanted to talk- See, I know, I know, I know! That's what I wanted to talk to you about. I talked to Issa about it, and she said she will volunteer. What did I tell everybody? What? Aren't you happy Issa is joining the trip? Very happy. Oh, um, of course I'm happy. Thrilled, even. A school trip with Ethan and her girlfriend? Who's also my teacher? How could I not be thrilled? Yikes! Yikes! So, that, that was, that was it. We've got six more chapters after this one so you guys are in for a wild ride it's also apparently taking ages for them to finally do something but we can't change anything about it now can we i hope you guys liked it if you did give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you haven't subscribed yet and then you guys will see me in one of my next videos bye guys We've been dancing for so long under the stars I feel that the grass will cut through my skin All the pills we take have seemed to prolong Our existence